it was kind of one of those you know, I haven't done the 200 free all year, and uh, Todd, my coach, was just kind of like saying, just just have fun, you know? Um, you're a competitor, you're a racer, uh, just do what you do best and just go out, have fun, and try and hold on to the lead. Oh, man, that means a ton. Um, you know, the past 20, 24, 48 hours, um, all the realizers were like, well, like, what's this thing about it? What if we win? What about this momentum swing that's going to happen for the next 24 or next day, next morning? And um, even coming into the meet, they were saying, like, NC State is still the underdog. Even though we have a national title, we've, we're up there and we're still somehow the underdog. But I think this is, this is going to catapult this into that, um, that realm of being those teams you always talk about as being the top competitors. I'm not nervous at all about Soren ever being the anchor. Um, he's always been in that position. He loves that position, and he he just has the mentality of like, I don't care if I'm really hurting, but I'm gonna push myself to beat that guy next to me. And if there's some guy next to him, like you can almost bet that Soren's gonna outtouch him. If he's gonna find a way to beat him. I don't know. <laughs> I saw the uh, I saw some articles about Caleb leading off about that, and Blake and I were talking about it. How cool it would be to have us three kind of uh, like rematch from I don't know Rio and the Olympics and whatnot. But now he's uh, we'll see what he has in store for tomorrow.